Hey, welcome back to Feral Art, the Nate's Art Lab Collaboration Edition. How you doing? Mm. Ah, today we're working on, first of all, a 20 by 20 level 3 artist loft canvas. I have painted my sides and edges and I have taped and push pinned the back. This month's collaboration is all about tinting and shading color. Um, so my color to start out with is Liquitex Basics Deep Green Permanent. I have shaded it with Amsterdam's Onyx Black and I have tinted it with Amsterdam's Titanium White. Um, so the tinted one turns out lighter and the shaded one turns out darker. Um, also we were supposed to add a metallic. So I chose DecoArt's Americana Decor Metallics in Deep Sapphire. So I have a dark green, a light green, a really dark green, and a teal. And I have chosen to pair those up or set those up with um, bronze and white with some iridescent white in it. So that being said, all of my colors will be down below in my um, description box. Wording is hard. It's wheel wheel hard. Anyway, so let's just get down on the canvas and get going. How about it? So for today's pour, I've chosen to do, I believe, a straight pour. Um, galaxy pour in the style of Sarah Mac. So for a 20 by 20 inch canvas, we need about 14 ounces of paint. That is length times width. And then you take that and you divide it by 28. Come up with 14.28, so 14.3, so 14 and a half. Start with a puddle of white.
gonna roll over ourselves. So, yep. Yeah. Put a little bit more flow up here. to the center and down to that other corner Good. And back to the center soft green just like I've always heard of the little green men maybe this is where they come from I think it's cool so I'm going to do a little clean up and then I'll bring you in for a little flyover how's that okay here we are with our wet results of our tinting and shading and metallicing experiment for Nate's art lab I think this is really pretty it's very soft which is not what I ever expect when I'm working with green. So I'm pretty happy with it. Um, the colors are different, but not painfully so. Um, the deep sapphire seems to have come out of this pretty strong. I love that ghosted part in the middle right there. Like, that is so cool. Um, putting that white in the bottom of our cup served us well for our middle end, whatever you want to call it there. I really like the fingerlings in this. They're there, but they don't overtake the whole thing. I think they're pretty. I love the soft, soft look of this. I usually don't get that. Usually mine are bold and weird. And 
I really like this. I think it's very pretty. I might have it upside down. I don't know. It's so hard to tell with these. Anyway, there we go. And just because we can, let's look at the, the shimmer of this baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Isn't that pretty? She's just pretty. I really, really am appreciating these lines a lot. I love this big, dark, deep secret of a place right there. Look at that metal glimmer. I just... You know, you don't know when you start off with an experiment whether it's going to work or be crap. <laughs> but I really like this a lot. I love that dark, dark green. It's like a, some kind of night emerald or something. Anyway, this is our wet results. And I will be back with dry results. How about it? Okay? Okay. See you in a little while. Okay, here we have the dried results of my Nate's Art Lab collaboration painting with the tinting and the shading and the metallicizing of my color, which was Liquitex Basics Deep Green Permanent. Got some great line work here and some fingerlings, some cells. Here we go. I think she's pretty. Um, she's very green. As I said earlier, maybe this is the galaxy that the little green men come from. I don't know. But this section right here just really kicks it, I think. Um, I really enjoyed doing this painting. I enjoy doing the straight pours, though. I think they always turn out pretty and interesting. I really like the sort of black hole effect of them. So anyway, there we go. Lovely dried results. And really, if you haven't joined Nate's Art Lab, it is fun. The people are great. And we have these wonderful collabs once a month. So give it a shot if you're of a mind too. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me. And I'll see you next time.